for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Welcome back to the weather. High of 71. Low of 47. 20 percent chance for rain. Happy birthday, Anthony Davis. Today is National Johnny Appleseed Day and National Oatmeal Nut Waffles Day. There's six more days till St. Patrick's Day. Thursday is 6th grade cone of ice. Spring, Spring pictures on Thursday. So these are some questions that students can answer and about what they like about art and what they suggest about it. Okay. So why do you suggest students to apply for art? I think that people should sign up for art because I, it gives them, them an opportunity. The most obvious is to be creative. And the second thing is because we are not on a state-based testing schedule, so I think that they have an opportunity, we as teachers have an opportunity to, to connect more with the student and let them know that although we're in a hurry to get to the next project, we can actually get to know you more by what you draw, what you express, how you color, and we can work harder on technique and the higher your technique and the more you understand that technique the higher your confidence. What do you think some students favorite things are about art? I think coloring, cutting, pasting. I think that just arranging elements on a piece of paper makes you feel a sense of accomplishment and failure and failing means that you get an opportunity to make corrections and those corrections are immediate. You get immediate results and you can either feel great about those results and keep that the way it is or you can make some edits and you can refine your composition and, it, and you can do those things instantaneously and you feel accomplished when you get to see process. And what, did, what do you think? Um, so, some students said that a lot of their favorite things are, like, if some are passionate, their favorite things are to be creative and okay. create their own ideas in an uh, appropriate way. Okay. Or a positive manner. In a positive manner, in an appropriate way. So, making relevant things happen on a piece of paper, right? And, um, what are some of the projects you've been doing in art? Some of the projects, um... What I teach is ranging from ceramics to 7th grade art, then to 8th grade art, then to ceramics, then 7th grade, then 8th grade. And so we hit on a lot of compositional fundamentals where you actually draw shapes instead of an orange. A lot of people go, that's a hard orange to draw, so then they start looking for clip art. But then I tell them to draw the shapes that they see within the orange and then no longer is it difficult. So it's really shaping people their perspective on what they're drawing. So we're doing some painting, we're doing some drawing, we're doing some oil pastel. Right now my seventh graders are exploring the materials used by the masters like Da Vinci, like Picasso, like Lichtenstein and um, a, a wide genre of artists because they explored different things. 
from photography to lithography to drawings and whatnot. So they're getting to explore all of those things and then tell me about that process. So it's kind of cool that we're doing a lot of, a lot of different media. Thank you.